have this conversation in this country that, oh, we don't have a plan. We're just running around. We don't have a plan. We're just participating in what everybody's doing. But when you actually examine uh, what we are working with, there are two major instruments that I think can help us as a basis. And then we can rather have a conversation on whether or not these are good enough and there are parts that we have to tweak. Within the first year of this administration, we have come up with a plan, not just for the four years, but a plan which we hope can extend to the next um, seven years or eight years. This plan has clarity on a number of pillars that we need to achieve. You scan the global landscape and ask yourself, where can I find resources to fill this? I have a couple of slides that if I have um, a few minutes, I would want to uh, show on the screen. And those slides tell you quite clearly that if you look at what we need to do as a country, today the average Ghanaian in this country believes that government should be doing maybe two or three times as much as it is, uh, as it is doing now. Whether it's roads or infrastructure or healthcare or education or whatever, government should be doing about three times. That literally sounds like government should be spending about two and a half times its budget. I won't even say three if we are considering efficiency. If you look at how much domestic resource you can mobilize, and you compare and you look at the gap, you have to find a place to get other resources. So you have two options. Are you going to go for debt? Or are you going to also go for some sort of partnership that you can leverage to get the resources to deliver what you are looking for? <music>